right, there's huge news in the music world. Legendary polka recording being reissued with an awesome, fresh twist. Friend of the show, president of Cleveland International Records, Steve Popovich Jr., joining us live by Zoom. Hey, Steve, what's going on, man? Hey, Todd. Hi, Stephanie. How are you guys hey. doing? Great to we're see you great. again. Great. Yes, good to see you. So happy that Good to see you, too. Been a long time. Yeah, so happy we're reissuing Frankie Yankovic and Friends, Songs of the Polka King. We got the albums here. We're showing them. It's uh, just, that's very cool. I'm glad you guys were able to do this. Awesome. Yeah, thank you. We're very excited about it. So talk about, I, I, Todd and I were laughing because I was supposed to be looking up, but I was enthralled with the back of this with Drew Carey. So Drew has been super yeah. supportive with you guys, and he wrote something that's so special and was talking about him playing the accordion since he was a little boy yeah. and then picked it back up Absolutely. over COVID. I mean, it's just really incredible to see his support for you guys. Absolutely. You know, Drew's been, uh, you know, a huge supporter, um, you know, with, with our projects over the years, you know, uh, primarily with the, the Frank Yankovic Songs of the Pope King Volume 1, which he was a really, uh, he was originally on. And, um, you know, I reached out to him, um, I'd say probably about six, seven months ago to see if he'd be willing to write the liner notes for the record. And, you know, he said, absolutely. And, um, you know, the rest, they say, is history. So, yeah, we're excited about it, you know. So my dad always said uh, polka uh, was his people's Prozac. You can't listen to polka and be in a bad mood. And, you know, I think in today's day and age, with everything going on in the world today, you know, it's time to roll out the barrel and bring back the polka heroes. Oh, I love, I love it. it, yeah. Talk about just Frankie and this whole album and the concept and who's all on it. Yeah, absolutely. So, you know, my family uh, and, and Frank, you know, go back 60 plus years. Uh, you know, Frank was actually the first uh, person who gave my father uh, his first job in the record business back in 1962 wow. at Columbia Records Warehouse in Cleveland, Ohio. So that relationship uh, always stayed strong through the years. In 1986, my dad won the first Polka Grammy with Frank. And, um, you know, when my dad and I moved back to Cleveland back in 1994, uh, he restarted Cleveland International, and he wanted to pay homage and tribute to America's polka king, Frank Yankovic. So, you know, we, we put out volume one and then volume two back in 97, 98, both were Grammy nominated. And, uh, you know, like I said, you know, it, uh, I think the timing is perfect. Uh, it's the first time it's ever been available on vinyl. Um, I did tweak the artwork a little bit. Um, you know, uh, originally uh, a gentleman, uh, Ed Shimborski, um, who was a uh, school teacher in Toledo, Ohio, he, um, you know, drew um, the album cover and added a lot of the key um, uh, places uh, uh, for, for, for polka music. And uh, I made sure to put the Beach Beachland Ballroom on there front and center because they've been a tremendous supporter, Cindy Barber uh, and everyone over there. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you well, know, it's, Steve, it's you mentioned now. it. We're that, actually... that album cover is so fun to it look is. at. I mean, really, it's so yeah. pleasing, so fun. 23 of the greatest polka songs. And as you said, it's so true. You can't listen to polka and not be happy. I mean, here, who stole the kishka? In heaven, there is right. no beer. Whoop de doo. Two fat polka. Cleveland, the polka town. I mean, these are classic, the awesome songs. Hey, before we go, they Steve, really uh, are. Uh, just uh, let's talk about the event that's coming up and where you guys are going to be and how people can get the record. Yeah, so we're, we're having a, uh, an album launch party at the Beachland Ballroom on Sunday, November 28th. So if you're looking to burn some of those Thanksgiving calories, feel free to head down to the Beachland and, uh, you know, do some dancing. And um, I believe tickets are $15 at the door and they're $25, uh, which will include a, a CD as well awesome. um, of the album. So you can go to beachlandballroom.com, order your tickets. Uh, Joey Miskelin. Uh, who is the world's greatest uh, accordion player and played with Frank since he was 13 years oh, wow. old. Uh, he will be performing along with his band, playing all the classic uh, polka hits. Love it. Um, and you could also get uh, the album at clevelandinternational.com as well. And I'm glad you mentioned CD available too, right. in case you don't have an old fashioned record player. <laughs> my mom played the accordion, so mom, you're getting the album. Oh, congrats. <laughs> all right, but a great right stocking awesome. stuffer, a great Christmas gift. Steve, we'll see you the, th the Sunday after Thanksgiving there at the Beachland, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank you guys. That's right, awesome. Thank you so much. Yeah. This is great. What a great Christmas gift, holiday That's gift. Very true. You know, really, it's rich here in our mm -hmm. Cleveland blood, isn't it? <laughs>